What's up everybody? I'm back with another uh, roller coaster review. This is the final roller coaster review from Hershey Park, uh, from the Hershey Park trip that I did at least uh, back in July. So um, that is awesome. And it is of Laugh Track, their spinning indoor uh, coaster released in 2015. So um, quite a while ago now actually, but this was my second to last ride of the day, um, was my last new coaster, and uh, I got one, so I only got the one ride in on this thing. Um, but anyway, I got some thoughts on it, so let's jump right into it, shall we? First off, this ride is advertised as having an indoor line with air conditioning, that's a big piece of it. Um, but when I was in line, I realized it's not really. Um, the first part of the line is outdoor. It's just under a cover, so you're away from the sun, but not like you're not in air conditioning. And then you get into the inside part, and that's not air conditioned at all. Uh, really, or at least it didn't feel like it was air conditioned. It's indoor, so but you're not air conditioning. Um, so that was stupid. I. I I think the actual ride itself where the coaster is, that's air conditioned, but I don't think anything else is. I don't even think the station was. The station might have been. I don't remember exactly, but that was stupid. Um, but as far as for that, in the outdoor part of the queue, no theming at all. When you go in, there's some theming in the indoor queue, which is pretty cool. You got like the, the funny mirrors that make you... Uh, do the, the funny stuff there. Um, so it's, it's like a carnival magic mirror esque type uh, theme that they've got going here. So um, that's really cool. And then once you get into the station for the ride, um, there's a glow light. And anybody's wearing like white or like bright colors, their their uh, stuff will glow, which is really really cool too. Um, I like that. So and then the ride itself uh, has a lot of theming and a lot of lights and. Um, like posters and spinning stuff around um, to feel like that crazy esque carnival clown theme to it. So they did a good, they did a pretty decent job with the theming overall um, with with this ride. So, um, and now the ride experience. I mean, it's just like a spinning. It's supposed to be a spinning coaster. Um, and I don't know if it's just because I rode it with a bunch of random people who were also heavy, so we didn't. But we didn't spin that much. Um, I thought it would spin more. It took a while for it to spin. Uh, once it did start spinning near the end of the ride, it did pick up a good amount. But it just took a while for it to do that. And I was hoping that we get a little more from that. I was a little disappointed. But um, to be honest, maybe that was probably a good thing. Um, I don't know. Uh, but, I mean, the ride experience is what you expect. There's some pretty good, the drops are pretty good. Um, get some good speed for some very fast-paced um, ride with the turns and, and stuff. You're kind of flying around the little course. Um, the black light experience, I thought it would have been a little bit more like you... I thought it would have been a little bit more um, you couldn't see anything. Except for, like, the illuminated stuff in, in the ride. You can't really, I mean, so it didn't feel like super dark. I mean, it's darker than normal, but it kind of just felt like a night ride on an outdoor coaster. Um, so nothing new that I haven't experienced before. So that was a little underwhelming too, but... Um, oh, well. There was nothing that really caught me off guard, even though I did start the ride backwards. Um, and there's nothing that really caught me off guard for the ride. Uh, but good pacing, I, I thought, overall. It was pretty hard to enjoy this ride, though, because of the fact that I got mega stapled on this ride. And, you know, oh well. Uh, I have to be safe, and I easily see why once we started the ride, but... Yeah, I mean, it was nice. I had to uh, enjoy it, but... And I had to ride this alone, so that's probably why I didn't... Because uh, my brother can't do the, the spins, so that was um, a little awkward to ride with a bunch of randos but yeah they were nice so shout out to those guys you guys were nice good people um for a little bit that i talked to you for so anyway that's really it uh, this ride was pretty underwhelming 
all things considered. Um, it wasn't rough. It wasn't, like, horrible. It was just a little underwhelming for, like, the hype that I was seeing from people. And, uh, so, you know, that's whatever. Um, so my final score for Laugh Track, probably just a 7 out of 10. It's a weak, it's one of the weaker coasters in the park. And, um, it also had the longest line. I forgot to mention that. It, it has the longest, it had the longest line. And that's because the capacity for this ride is not that good. Um, whereas I'm, I'm not doing it, I'm not doing a review of Wild Mouse because I already viewed Wild Mouse Michigan's Adventure and they're very much the same. But on the Wild Mouse, the cars are moving. So you get in, you lock yourself in real quick, you go. Laugh Track, I kind of felt like was going, I thought was going to be the same thing. It's the same amount of people per car, and you just get in and you go. Um, but there's a, but they have to spend a lot more time with the restraints, making sure they lock right. And I get it, the ride spins, and it's banked, and you know you want to make sure you don't do that kind of stuff. But I feel like it's just a little too extensive, and it kind of slows everything down, especially with only four people again per car so so in my opinion it's lower on my rankings of coasters at the park so anyways that's gonna do for this coaster review of you for in laugh track let's know your thoughts about it in the comment section down below and that's it for all the hershey park stuff from this trip um as soon as i get on more coasters and get more credits i will uh review them here on the channel as soon as i possibly can um and uh, but anyway stay tuned for other much more amazing content however and until next time, I will see you guys later. Goodbye.